Hi everyone, it's me Paula and I'm here to do um just two project shares. The first one that I did, um I used tons of nets. Both of them I used lots of transform nets um zibit. I'm going to put um post her link down below so you guys can go check her out and also her YouTube. And the first one I did, I did an altered envelope card and it's just these regular envelope and then on the inside it's just the paper and this is what it looks like. Um let me see if I can move you guys so that I can see what I'm doing here. So what I did is I added um, from this paper collection, which I love, and I'm hoarding the little bit of paper that I have left of it. <laughs> this is um, by um, Brenda Walton by K and Company. And the papers are super gorgeous. They're very pretty. Look like this. So I used that paper pad. And um, what I did is I went with a green because I, I barely use any green on my projects. And um, so I used this paper and then white on the background, white cardstock. And then here, I kind of just overdid it on the embellishment. <laughs> but um, I added this pretty eyelet lace that Nat has in her shop, really, really pretty. And then on, I just added this one on top. This is new on her store. And it's um, it has little tiny seed beads. So pretty. And then I added a little piece that I had in my stash and I just curled the edges as lucky and I don't know if you guys can see but I glossy accented the little bird and I added this pretty um butterfly and then I added from the same paper collection I just added a bunch of little butterflies and some flatbacks up here here is just some some sprays and some flowers that I had in my stash a gardenia um here's this one with like organza and then this one which I just plucked out of a spray that I had of flowers and I also added here some of her trim as well. And then this one she also sent me. It's pretty. This very pretty. Um, this is like iridescent. And then I added a small um, flower cluster here. And then some of these Valentine hearts. I got these from um from Dollar Tree a while back. And then I just used my um I forgot I think it's floral by Spellbinders the floral one the floral or the lacy ovals I forget which one it is. But it's very pretty and I just added the flat backs, the pink one. And then I was supposed to add an image here, but I I had already added the flowers, so I just added a little butterfly there. And then on the inside it's just the paper. Um just for me to write the message. And then the second project, I really like how it came out. I did like um a single banner, and the only thing I have to do is add the the um the ribbon up here so that the person can hang it off of. And this is I just this is with um let me see if I can find it's this one that Tim holds alterations and it's um called butterfly and this is what it looks like. I don't know if you guys can see that, but um I just um cut it both times through my I ran it um twice through my machine and then I just um folded the wings to make it look like this and I added a little um blue flat backs for the little body. And I went with um very light blue flat backs all around. And again from Nat's trim. And then I added this pretty trim here. And then here is another um of the same the punch. And that is this one here by Martha Stewart. So that's what it looks like. And then I added um some flowers. I just made this rolled flower just using my EK Success scallop circle and then I just added a bunch of um different flowers and so this is what it looks like and this trim also Natalie has sent me very beautiful and then um here's a stick pin that I had added I don't know if you guys can tell sorry for moving all over the place you guys so that looks like that and then this image a while back Heather has sent me and I just added that there I added a little a little on um, flat back for her necklace and then I added a little tiny butterfly up here so she is like looking at the flowers over here so um, I thought this came out so pretty I have pictures on on Facebook if you guys um want to want to search for me it's um vpaula98 at yahoo.com and my Instagram I'll leave the link below I just made a new one so I don't have any pictures but it's um vpaula86 I'll just leave the links below so you guys can um check it out so thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to 
um, upload this video and get to making a few more crafts. So thank you all so much for watching again. Have a very blessed day and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.